I am Sujit Rukal Chitri, one of the graduate students working in the research project titled Acoustic Cyclone Attacks on Additive Manufacturing Systems. The main objective of this research project is to design novel acoustic attack model for demonstrating the vulnerability of current state-of-the-art additive manufacturing systems. Currently, security issues in additive layer manufacturing are only considered in cyber domain. However, it can be attacked from the physical domain as well through side channels. Side channel attacks have been successful in system that incorporate cryptographic computation. In additive manufacturing, the components of the system leak information through the side channels such as power, EMI, and acoustics. These leaked information have high mutual information with the corresponding cyber domain data such as G-code. Hence, we can use this side channel information to infer about the cyber domain data. 3D printer uses stepper motor for actuating control movement. The internal structure of these stepper motors consists of permanent and electromagnets. When the current supplied to the electromagnet varies, the stepper motor produces audible sound corresponding to the varying current. We can even play music by passing corresponding G code to these printers. Even when printing meaningful objects, the 3D printer emits audible sound. The sound produced has a unique fingerprint corresponding to the speed of the nozzle and the corresponding motor involved. By reverse engineering these sounds, we can figure out what the printer is printing and hence its G-code. In our acoustic attack model, an attacker may place an audio device such as a smartphone close to the 3D printer and record the sound emitted by it while printing an object. Our acoustic attack model consists of different learning algorithms that extract specific information about the G-code from the acoustics recorded. The accuracy of the reconstructed object depends on the accuracy of the different learning algorithms. For classification models, we have obtained high true positive rates. Whereas for the regression models, the mean square error of the learning algorithms are very low. Our experimental setup consists of an audio recorder, a 3D printer, and a printing software. We have defined speed, distance, and complexity as different test parameters. For these parameters, we obtain 78.35% average access prediction accuracy and 17.82% average length prediction error. As a test case to combine different test parameters, we have printed an outline of a key. For this object, the perimeter accuracy obtained after the post-processing is 89.72%. From our experiments, we conclude that consideration for the defensive mechanisms against site channel attacks is necessary in additive manufacturing systems.